The tremendous density of a black hole is its defining feature. A black hole is a mysterious object with a massive amount of matter packed into a tiny or even zero amount of space. The result is a tremendous gravitational force from which not even light can escape, leaving us with no knowledge or insight into what life is like inside. What we would like to understand is what happens inside a black hole or at its center. We know what happens outside the black hole as you approach its event horizon, the dreaded point of no return. The event horizon is the threshold around the black hole where the escape velocity surpasses the speed of light. To escape the black hole's gravity, you'd have to travel faster than light, which is impossible for any bit of matter. Inside the event horizon, physics takes a turn for the worse. According to calculations, the appearance of the fabric of space-time inside a black hole is dependent on the black hole's history. It could be turbulent, twisted, or anything else. But one thing is certain, the tidal forces would kill you. According to theory, within a black hole there exists a singularity. A singularity is what all the matter in a black hole gets squashed into. Some describe it as a point in space-time with infinite density at the black hole's center. But according to quantum mechanics, that's impossible. It is what classical physics says is there, but the singularity is also where classical physics breaks down, so we shouldn't trust what it says. In a particular mathematical case, the singularity in a spinning black hole becomes a ring, not a point. However, in reality, that mathematical circumstance will not exist. Others argue that the singularity is a whole surface within the event horizon. We don't know that. It is possible that singularities don't exist in actual black holes. What do you think would happen if you fell into a black hole? When items and material are dragged into a black hole, they will undergo a process called spaghettification. This is because when you approach the black hole, gravity becomes so extreme and increases so rapidly that your head and feet would experience significantly different gravitational environments. You'd be physically stretched out and time would slow to a crawl in the short period before you fell into the singularity, the zero point of the black hole itself. Technically, this happens just outside the black hole but the truth is that astronomers have no idea what occurs once you enter the singularity. For Schwarzschild black hole, non-rotating and not charged, physical forces mandate that you would be reduced not to cells or even atoms, but to a perfect sea of energy, devoid of all trace of the object you were before. Your mass is added to that of the black hole, and you become the object of your own destruction. Thanks to general relativity, we think we understand what happens in this extreme gravity. With the help of quantum mechanics, we can make an intelligent estimate as to what happens at smaller, microscopic scales. However, when the two theories are merged, as they would be at the center of a black hole, they collapse, leaving us with no understanding of what's going on. In the case of a charged Reisner-Nordstrom or rotating Kerr black hole, it is possible to avoid the singularity. Extending these solutions as far as possible reveals the hypothetical possibility of exiting the black hole into a different space-time with the black hole acting as a wormhole. The possibility of traveling to another universe is, however, only theoretical, since any perturbation would destroy this possibility. It also appears to be possible to follow closed time-like curves returning to one's past around the Kerr singularity, leading to problems with causality like the grandfather paradox. It is expected that none of these peculiar effects would survive in a proper quantum treatment of rotating and charged black holes. 
the long-lasting nature of black holes leads scientists to speculate that towards the end of the universe, when there is no stuff left to make new stars, and when all the existing stars have burned up, the universe will be dominated by black holes. A dark and uninviting scenario.